A former Royal Oster. A former Royal O. Royal. A former Royal Ulster Constabulary Police Inspector, which is now the PSNI, who previously denied charges of being in possession of indecent images of children, has grown some balls and changed his plea. 63-year-old Raymond Keith Lindsay from Killiman Road, Dun Dungannon, is already a convicted sex offender, but appears to have committed the new offence sometime between 2016 and 2018. Three years ago, Lindsay was jailed for trying to lure a child into woods at Castle Wellham Forest Park on the 26th of July 2018. The child was said to have been on a camping holiday with her parents. She was said to have been walking with her four-year-old sibling when she first became aware that Lindsay was following them. Although the child didn't talk to Lindsay, he began talking to her, asking the age. The girl eventually replied that she was eight, to which Lindsay said, you're too young. He asked if the girl would like to take off her underwear. She refused and he persisted in asking if she wanted to come into the woods and he would take off his underwear and show her his genitals. The girl and her sibling made off and reported what had happened to her parents who then called the police. Pedo Lindsay was visited by police later that day and asked where he had been to which he said he had been in all day and he had not left the house but a park ranger at the area that he approached the girl in found a white van parked up which was registered to Lindsay so he then said he went out to lunch with his mother but his mother denied being with him at all now that's not the only time this former police inspector had been caught because the incident with the girl in the woods was committed while he was on probation and as a result of that arrest he was recalled to serve the remainder of a sentence given to him in 2016 for a similar offence. Lindsay appeared at Dungannon Crown Court via video link from his solicitor's office where he admitted 15 counts of making indecent images and 5 counts of possessing indecent images of a child. Lindsay was meant to stand trial in the next few days. His admission comes before his trial could actually start. Lindsay's defence counsel conceded that there are very relevant convictions on record, the first in 1993. The same year he had become an inspector with the Royal Ulster Constabulary, the now PSNI, but shortly after reaching this rank he was arrested for his first sexualised offending and was jailed and on release a similar incident occurred in 1996 for which he was also jailed. So basically this is a prolific sexual offender who, if you ask me, should spend the rest of his days in a concrete box, preferably underground. On release there was again further offending in 2012 with Lindsay serving another prison sentence from which he was released in October 2016. He was first jailed in 1994 for 16 uh, sex offences including gross indecency, indecent assault having been arrested after a high-speed chase through Belfast. A court was later told Lindsay used his position as a Royal Ulster Constabulary Inspector to target vulnerable victims. Surprise, surprise. He would approach schoolgirls and ask them if they needed help before abusing them. The judge at Dungannon Crown Court ordered pre-sentencing reports to be completed with sentencing expected to take place next month. Lindsay's been ordered to sign the sex offenders register, the length of time of which he will be determined at the sentencing. Dirty, filthy, prolific, paedophile bastard. Doesn't deserve to live in a community of normal people. Well, relatively normal. More normal than him. <laughs>